watch out for the stick tights. Don't need them all over your pants. There are some knots on that. This is a place never checked out before. Looks like the back side of a neighborhood. Yeah. Look at all these little baby trees. Isn't that awesome? This one looks awful dry to me. What's the base look like? It's rotted, but it's got some solid to it. No, it's completely rotted. Not worth it. Yeah, there's more over there. Nothing to write home to mom about yet. We'll find another spot. I see some trees with some potential branches, but yeah, that was about the best fat wood I saw is when we first come in. Yep, that's the closest thing to fatwood that we saw. <laughs> yeah, it's not worth the hassle. This one almost looks resinous, but that's all fungi. Fungi to be with. Yep, yes you are. <laughs> We're back out here again for the second day. Come on, Steve. I found pine knots over here and a trail. Check these pine knots out. Just like that free pine knot. It's uh, not the best quality. Be interesting to crack into. Yeah, they're awful broken. They're not the best quality. Not sure I'd want to waste my time with them. They're pretty big though. The old pine fence post. Steve, look. Oh. Yeah, the water in this punk wood will weigh your pack down. Wow, look at the size of this one. Oh, and it's loose. Even better. Yep. We're going to leave that pile right there. We're going to go check out this trail. There's some neighborhoods around here. Wow, bunch of trash back here. Even more trash. Look at all these scotch pine. They're all small and bushy. Yeah, it's either a freaking teenager's playground or a homeless camp. Man. Good golly. I never would have guessed this from the side of the road. I see more pines. All kind of deer back here. Tons of deer. I don't see no neighborhood. Oh, there it is. Neighborhood's over there. I was checking out this stand of trees and they're just too bushy. So, uh... We've walked this path. All we found were the pine knots, and we've got the trail going back. And uh, we're gonna go gather those pine knots. It's real tempting to walk that trail to check out that new forest. 
I was banging all the rot off of this and the whole knot is rotten and I just was left with this little needle of fatwood. Knocked it all off. See that? Ain't that something? Just a cone. This one can go like that, carry it alone. That's a hell of a knot. So is this one. Look at that thing. That's all we got for today, but it sure is pretty awesome. It's got a lot of rotten wood on it, but these are two big, very big pine knots. Kind of cool how these are coned. They rotted rather funny. These pine knots have no resin in them. At least don't appear to be. I've been fooled. There's no resin in these pine knots. Not even the cone. These are pine knots that Steve's brought. We'll go over those. You want to hold the camera for me? Sure. This is not from the Fabwood Hunt. This is what Steve brought. And look at the golden goodness. That's pretty good. That's from one end to the other. That's a big score right there. That's incredible. That's a nice piece. What else do we got? This one here is solid resin there. Solid resin up to here. Got a little bit of dry right there. A little bit there. A little bit in the center. I suppose if we cut that branch off. That little knot was loaded with resin. We'll go ahead and split this one up. There we go. Look at that. Dang. That's pretty awesome. That makes me want to grab a ferro rod. Wow. Holy smokes, man. Talk about golden goodness. Wow. Oh my gosh, that's cool as hell, man. I hardly ever find it that red. Look at that. Turn it a little so I can see the other side, other way, there you go. Good Lord, turn it back. Wow, <laughs> holy cow. Gonna have to fire that up. Those are nice pieces. This makes up for that faux fat wood. This is beautiful. You've got some nice fat wood in your area. Look at that. <laughs> Stonehenge made out of wood. There you go, Stonehenge. Here you go. Man. Some beautiful stuff. Cuts like butter. Or as they say in New Jersey, butter. Butter. That's good stuff. Look at that. Ain't that something? 
That whole tree line is a forest of red pine. Steve and I come up here before we went for that fatwood hunt. And we walked up to here and looked around and that's about all we did. It was cold and it was getting dark quick. He's already gone home, but I'm gonna come in and take a peek. There's a bridge that comes all the way around and there's a little pedestrian bridge. So I'm real curious, because I've seen that big forest from the street in a different area, and I didn't know if I could get to the forest or not. There's a public path on it. Takes you right to it. Looks like, uh, looks like the path's split off, which is cool. That path down there, we're going to take, and we're going to go check that out gonna be uphill on the way back. I like downhill on the way back. Uphill on the way in. When you think about it, I mean, you're carrying a load on the way back. You're not carrying a load on the way in. Steve's sending me pictures of Fatwood as we speak. He's finding some incredible stuff out where he's at. Yep, there's another trail. Whoop! Spin you around. We're gonna go down this one and go check out these pines. Okay, we're coming up on it. Let me turn you around. Going into the shade. It's gonna get cold. Wow. I swear this forest looks bigger from the road, looks smaller from here. Tall standing pines. And they appear to be red pine, which is awesome. Oh, it smells so good. Oh, just got me a whiff. Smells beautiful. I don't know if this forest will provide anything or not. Most of the branches are small. Yeah, there's all kinds of dead pine around here. But these are all tall and straight. No big spiky branches. Plenty of down trees. No fatwood yet. down in a swampy area. Look at all them dead red pines. That's a lot of dead trees. I see no potential for good fatwood That's the closest I've seen to fatwood. Pretty rotten, wouldn't be worth it. Yeah, I see the bridge up ahead. I'm a bit bummed out, to be honest. This is the bridge that Steve and I saw when we were driving down the road. Ooh, this is slippery. I say thumbs down for fatwood in this forest. 
I'm sure I'll look around heavier someday. But it's not very promising. And that's it. That's it on the fatwood hunt.